for watching and stopping by our channel today. I am so excited to share this fun and quick and DIY project with you that literally takes things that you probably already have in your home and it's so fun and creative. I am just in love with this project. So today I'm going to be showing you step by step on how you can make your very own cork pumpkin decor. So if you guys have any spare corks lying around, go ahead and pull them out because you'll be needing them for this super cute and fun project. You know, all of us have corks lying around or sometimes you could just buy these like Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Actually, even at the Dollar Tree, I've seen them sell packs of just like the, like plain, plain corks like this that you can buy, just so you can do different crafts with them. So just briefly, what you will need, you're going to need about 25 corks. You're going to need a glue gun and glue sticks, of course. You're going to need orange paint. So I just picked up some acrylic paint and a paint sponge. And then you don't need this, but if you want to add a touch of wood foliage to your pumpkin, I just pulled off some leaves from an old um, garland that I had and then some twine. Let's get started. So what you're going to do is you're going to have a few different sets in number. So the first row that you're going to do is going to be of six. So we're going to just hot glue gun these together. So we're gonna do six and then followed by two rows of five and two rows of four. Okay, so once you have your rows, they should look something like this. Um, I applied a lot of glue just to make sure that it sticks on. So you have your two rows of four, two rows of five, and one row of six. You're just gonna pile them on top of each other and glue them down. When they're gonna stack, like lay stacked, it's not directly on top of each other. They kind of go in between. So you're gonna have to, to stick quite a bit of glue in the inside so that we make sure that they are really stuck together. And then we're just gonna let this dry and then prepare to start painting this side. Okay, so today we are using the Anita's All Purpose Acrylic Paint. This is in the color Pumpkin, and I'm going to just be painting this side of the surface in orange. Okay, so a part of the final last touch is cork number 25 to be the top part of our pumpkin. I'm just gonna go ahead and glue gun this part down as well. 
Okay, so for the last part, I'm going to use as a little touch is I'm going to cut some twine and just wrap it around and just, I kind of want some twine to fall in the front just for an added effect. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut some. And I'll just twist it around. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add the, the foliage. And there you go. This is pretty much the final product. It's just so cute, and this was so easy to make. Let us know if you have tried crafts with corks before and what you think about it. Let us know what you think about this one. I am really loving it. I think it's super cute and darling, and I can't wait to put this on my table for Thanksgiving.